What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Lynette underscore Katie. Guys, I'm on a cape because Mombasa is very hot. So guys, guess what? Guess what? <laughs> guess what guys? I'm actually in a yard, a car yard. So I'll be going to the showroom. So today I want us to learn something about the cars and also the prices of cars here in Kenya in 2024. You know most of the like most of the cars changes prices year yearly. So like this is 2024. You can't compare the price of, of this car here uh, with the 2023. So here we are guys, we are going to learn together. So I'm so excited being here guys. Huh? Uh, I'm so excited, you see? So I love this color. I think this is maroon if i'm not wrong yeah this is maroon wine red yeah wine red not maroon so i love this car the way it is here let me show you from behind it's actually a mazda car so this is a mazda i think it's a mazda axela or demo so let me call him so that he can explain chalo hello do you know that my husband is chalo <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. How about you? I'm good. Yes. Welcome to Mombasa. Thank you so much. So yes. guys, this is Chalo, just like Chalo Kush. Yes. Yeah, I'm so excited to be here and I can't wait to learn from you. So today we are coming live from this yard. Okay, your showroom is called uh, or your company? Uh, JM Superride. JM? Mombasa, Kenya. Okay, you can say it again. JM Superride. JM Superride? Mombasa. Mombasa. Yeah. Okay, so you're located only in Mombasa. Yeah, only in Mombasa. All right. But I'm um, hopeful. Uh -huh. As time goes by, I'll open a showroom in Nairobi. In Nairobi. Very soon. Wow, I'm praying for that. Yeah, so. I'm looking forward to it. Wow, yeah, that's please. nice. So I'm so excited and honored to be here today. Okay. And I can't wait to learn about this car. So there's a car I've already spot. Okay. Like I love it. This the red color. So I'm asking, is it Axela or Demio? <laughs> Uh, this one, the wine red. This one is a Mazda Xera, new shape. New shape. Yes, wow, new it's so it's super good. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. I think this one is manual. I don't know if you are okay with manual. Oh, this is manual. Hi, ah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how to ride a manual. I'm used to automatic. But for auto, it's there. We have point and crank. Mm. Uh, and metallic gear also there. Yeah. Okay. So you can check it out. Either of them. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, if you are Lynette, which color would you go for? So, you know, being a girl, we like bright colors. <laughs> Although it's a manual. So, I would like you maybe to walk me around. We see the cars that we have. And then later, maybe we open one and see inside, right? Yeah, so this is... A... This one is manual also. Mm. Okay, we can even open the manual. Okay. Yeah, there are some people who are... Like, who knows how to drive manual cars? The auto? The auto one is there. At the showroom? Yeah. We will see it from the showroom. Yeah, the four of them, they are all manual. Oh, like one, all two, three, them, four? Yeah, yeah. They are all manual. Yes. So which engine is that? Is like CC? This one is 1500 uh, CC. 1500 CC? Mm -hmm. It's a Sky Active Technology. Sky Active Technology. Yeah, what does it mean? This one is, uh, we call it, uh, it's a place but in uh, fuel consumption. Oh, in fuel consumption. Yeah, it uses is it a hybrid? No. Okay. Oh, okay. Wow, so guys, you've understood about Sky? Sky Active Technology. Mm -hmm. So it's like, in fuel consumption, it minimizes, yeah, yeah. it reduces. Wow, I love this car. I love this one here. <laughs> anyway, so let's walk around and see more cars that you have. Yes. So this one is a? This one is a Subaru Impreza G4 Saloon. Subaru Impreza G4 Saloon. Saloon. Yes. What was Subaru? Yes. Subi. <laughs> Subaru. Sport cars. Eh? Oh, this is a sport car. Yeah, even this one's a sport car. Eh? Oh, this one's a sport yes. cars yes. as well. Oh, nice. So this one is auto. Auto. Model, 26. New number. 2016 number it is unregistered unregistered so in case you purchase it mm -hmm. you will have to register the it like immediately and then you get a new number which is kdp oh yeah. oh nice yeah. so how much is this this one we are selling at uh, 1.6 1.6 million yes. and how many liters this one is uh, 
1.5 cc 1500 cc or 1500 liters some people call it liters yeah, but yeah. then what is cc cc is the engine capacity or oh, the engine capacity like the power that it can yeah. be able to pull yeah, yeah. all right so guys we are learning all of us so that's the meaning of cc you know i know like 1500 cc uh 200 cc but i don't know the 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 meaning but today i've learned that it's a capacity yes. Oh, the same, same. Yeah, hatchback. Oh, hatchback. This is saloon. So, guys, let me show you how the saloon is. So, this is the view of the saloon. Wow. Okay, so let's move on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for ladies, it's here. Yeah. Also, you have Nissan Note. Nissan Note. Nismo. Nismo. Yeah, this one. Latest new shape of Nissan Nismo. Nismo. Yeah, Nismo. Wow, how many cc? Uh, this one is a 1200 cc. 1200 cc. Uh huh. It's a full loaded car. Full loaded car. Full loaded. What does loaded. that mean? That one means mm. the car has uh, alloy rims. Alloy? Alloy rims. Alloy rims? Yes. Uh -huh. It has a wing camera. Uh huh. It has uh, steering controls. Steering controls? Yeah. Uh huh. Then uh, you can check uh, the car has uh, even a spoiler. Yeah, I see. Even this one, I was about to ask you about this spoiler, spoiler. and this, the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also, I was about to ask this because this, okay, for the little knowledge that I know, this one you have to add it by yourself. Those, so, these ones are the body kits. Eh? Oh, body kits. Yeah. Oh, so it came just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, how many cc? You'd say 1200. 1200. How much is it in Kenyan shilling? This one we are selling at 1.45. Guys, God is in my panda. Guys, God is in my panda means like cars have hiked the prices. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the what's the reason behind of the hiking of prices? You know, it was affected. The huh? costing of it, it was affected by the dollar. Oh, the dollar. Yeah, yeah. But right now the dollar has come to 145. But you know, we have the stock. Oh, the stock also. Oh, so you have to clear it. So before we cope, we have to clear the stock. Okay, let's say uh, there is a new car. Right now you are at okay. Kenya is at which uh, year? Uh, right now we are importing a 2017. 2017 model. So let's say you the 2017 models come with the same dollar that you, the same rate of the dollar that you have right now. Yeah. Will you sell with that rate? Or you put them together? No, huh? you sell with the current. Oh, the current. Yeah. Oh. So meaning the price will be, we be going be down. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Oh, wow, so this is 1.45. Yeah, <laughs> wow. Hi, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's now go to if another you car. Get, uh, old shape of it. Mm. Old shape of it is uh, the price is a little bit lower. Oh, the old shape. Yeah. Uh huh. Which uh, uh, we are selling at 1.1. 1.1 million. 10.50. 10.50. Oh wow, Nissan Nismo, guys. Yeah. Wow. This one is Nissan Note. Oh, Nissan Note. Yeah. Oh. Nissan Note. Okay, let me stand this way. Nismo Note. Yeah. Nismo. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Wow, it looks good. Eh? And yeah, it has yeah. one. Okay, I love this one. Also, it was added, right? Yeah, body, kit. body kit. Wow, this is so nice. Okay, let's go to another one. So, this is the same. 1050. Ten, uh, 1450 yes. you can get a note nismo at jm motors yes mm -hmm. now let's go to commercial here we have nissan serena nissan serena yeah, it's a seven seater, uh -huh. a seven -seater. Yes. and it's a hybrid this one is a hybrid i can see there's yeah. shy and it's shy hybrid right yeah, yeah. as hybrid yes. mm -hmm. so this one is a uh, 2000 cc 2000 cc 7 seater 7 seater you can do uh, psv mm. those people who do tsv mm. that is touring mm. they can uh, use this also it's a family car yeah actually it's a fa uh, that's what i wanted to say like yeah, it's yeah. a family car and this one uses petrol or yeah, diesel petrol, petrol. Yes. oh wow this is nice so 200 cc yeah, 7 seater CC. yeah 2000 cc a 7 seater how much is it uh, this one we are selling at uh, 1.7 1.7 million. Yes. Oh wow, Nissan. Another color. Another color. Wow. Okay. 
so some companies touring companies they usually use these ones yeah mm -hmm. and also we have another uh, toyota esquire toyota esquire is it the same like no this one is nissan this is so... okay yeah. but the shape is the same or they are almost the same huh? although this one huh? is in the category of uh, toyota noah and toyota box oh so it's another model yeah, yeah. Okay, is it a new model or it was there? This car, huh? uh, it has hit a market uh, last year and this year. Oh. So it's a new car that is competing with the Toyota no. Boxy and Toyota, Toyota no. yeah. so, so you said it's called? Toyota Esquire. Toyota Esquire. Yes. How many seats? Uh, it's, uh, you can get an 8-seater and a 7-seater. Okay, then 7-seater goes for? That one we are selling at 2.6. 2.6 million yes. okay and eight seater same same price same price yes. oh. so getting a seven seater and an eight seater eh. it is defined by the seat oh so you can get this seat uh -huh. here at the back of the passenger mm. uh, the driver uh. and get this car and you get someone to open it for us okay so oh, it's open oh, it's open uh -huh. oh. now this one is a seven seater seven it is defined seater. by this seat or oh, this seat yeah. if when there you, is another one if there, there is a, if this seats they are three yeah they are three that is a eight seater okay. because back they are three mm. two mm. and three wow so that's the difference yeah, yeah, yeah. okay can i get it yeah, yeah yeah okay so this is how it is guys so and there is this seat which is back here so that means it has a small boot right yeah okay but if you need a bigger boot you have to make those seats to to lie down, lie down. and then you put your yeah. things wow this is so nice guys so this is how it looks from here yeah so the controllers are just here some of the cars you find that the controllers are here okay so this is nissan that is toyota esquire toyota esquire yes. nice one so one thing i want you to clarify are these zero mileage or used cars no these cars are used used cars eh? yeah, yeah, yeah okay used for seven years mm. overseas there in japan mm. now for us here in kenya we call them new new eh, that's uh, <laughs> by the way that's that, that's how it is here guys we buy used cars from japan yeah. but it doesn't mean that like we don't have the zero mileage we still have the zero mileage yeah, right but the zero mileage you have to get them at Toyota Kenya. That's the only company that brings the zero, zero mileage at Toyota Kenya. Toyota Kenya, Isuzu. Uh, uh, those are the companies that bring in the zero mileage. Cars. Oh. Yeah, but oh, for us, we uh, call them Mtumba. Mtumba, Mtumba cars. cars. <laughs> Mtumba but means for us, used Kenya clothes. Clients uh, who are coming to purchase from us. Yes. In their mind, they know they are coming to purchase a new car. A new car, yeah. Whereby we tell them, uh, we are the first owner yeah. here in Kenya. Here in Kenya. Yeah, but the car is already used. Used in other... Seven good years. Yeah. Seven good years? Yeah. Oh, wow. So that means in Japan, you're not supposed to use a car more than seven years? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's the rule? Yeah. Because of the production yeah. or what? The sixth year, you have to take it back to the company mm. and then to the auction. Then you get another one. They give you another one. Yeah, a new a new car, zero oh, mileage. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so guys, you can hear that. This is a Toyota, uh, Toyota Noah. Toyota Noah. So this is the color that it came with. Yeah, it came with it. Yellow. Yeah. So I think some schools can just decide to go with this because they are not being encouraged That's to go and uh, maybe just writing the names of their school, but right? We had brought uh, around uh, how many? They were around four. Mm -hmm. You can see the two of them, they have already gone. Oh. Remaining two. Wow. I think even me, if I was the director of the school, I should go yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah. If I need this kind of a car, because already it's painted. Right. Yeah, by the way, the system of Kenya needs schools to paint all the cars yellow to identify. Because some, some cars used to get accident. So they decided that if you see a yellow car, you ident like you just probably know that there are some students, children inside there. So give them the priority. Yeah, so let's continue. Also, it's a seven oh, it's a seven-seater. Yes. Okay. Seven mm. 2000 cc. Those are commercial, all of them, even this one. These are Matatu, the PSVs. Matatu, yeah, mm -hmm. The auto diesel and the auto petrol. Mm. This is Master Bongo. Master Bongo. Yeah, Master mm. Bongo, the 11 seater. 
11. This one is a 14 seater. 14 seater, yeah. 11 seater. Yeah. So if I want to be a matatu owner, how much do I buy this? Now, this one, hmm. the costing of it has gone up. The cost of it? Yeah. Ah. Now we are selling it at 3.3, the auto diesel. Auto diesel? Yes. Auto diesel, that means it uses diesel. Yeah, it uses diesel. Yeah. Okay. And for PSV, they huh. normally use diesel. Oh, PSV, they yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. PSV means public service vehicles, yes, right? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so this one you are selling at 3.3, .3, but if you have a deposit of uh, around 1.5, we mm. can give you the car, then you the clear the balance. Around uh, 30 months. 30 months. Yeah. So that's a year plus. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's nice. We Not even a year, two years. Two years and a half. Yeah, two years and a half. Okay, so we have another car here. Okay. So this is a Bongo. Uh, this is Mazda Bongo. Mazda Bongo. Uh, this one is a 1600cc. That is a 2.8cc. Mm -hmm. Both of them, the black and the white. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So 2000cc and 1600cc. That means this has more power compared to the 1600 yeah, cc this one it normally comes in petrol only. oh petrol only yeah, yeah. the mazda bongo yes. oh this oh this is mazda yeah, yeah. okay one thing i've realized after you walk like we've walked around you see for example uh the nissan the iogaria nissan in yokoko when you compare to the toyota they're almost the same shape yeah, yeah. same size but when you go to toyota it's kind of the price is half yeah, yeah. compared to nissan and mazda right the demand is Oh, the demand is still for Toyota. Oh, so guys, they always say they always the car in front of you is Toyota <laughs> in Kenya. Anyway, uh huh. Mm, Nissan Tiana. How much is it at this? 1.8. Really? Oh, this is sel selfie. Mm -hmm. This is Tiana. Okay. Oh, what about the sitter? They, um, there is somehow they okay. Is it your material in a kavanga? Yeah, leather seats. Both of them they are both in seats, but they are dark in seats. Oh, okay, okay, all right. So let's walk. So this is another selfie here, and the pro box. This one now is the old ship of the. You remember we saw yeah. the Nissan mm. Now this is old ship. So how much is it? Ten fifty. Yeah, that one I got it. Yeah, yeah. So Nissan not ten fifty. It's a normal one. Uh huh. It has no alloy rims, mm. no body kit, mm. no spoiler. Mm. The ship also mm. determines the price. Yeah. <laughs> the shape determines the price guys and also the body kit stuff that has been uh enhanced this tilda, tilda. Yeah, this mm. tilda. Mm -hmm. so this one we are selling at 1.4 1.4 million yes. oh yeah, how million. many cc or how many liters 1500 cc 1500 cc yes. all right yeah. so the tiana was uh tiana cc is 2.4 2.4 yeah. all right mm -hmm. So there is a 2.5 and there is a 2.4 of yes. Fonny Santana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The 2.5 goes at? We are selling the same price. Eh? Oh, same price. Yeah. Oh, okay. So let's walk and see more. I can see Kavits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This one is Nissan. Uh, this is Toyota Axio. Toyota Axio? Yes, a 15 and this is 5 seater. 5 seater. Yeah. 5 seater. Okay. So we are selling at 1.65. 1.65. Yeah, 16.50. 1 million six hundred and fifty. Uh-huh. We have Suzuki Alto. Suzuki Alto. This one we are selling at uh, 750. 750. Yeah, that is less a million. You know there is a, a, a time, guys, uh, actually like we asked about this price when Chalo used to do Uber. So we asked the price of this. Do you know it was at around 450? Yeah. For, you can agree with that. It was around 450. I sold so many at 400. 400? Yeah. Okay. So right now it's at? Right now it's 750. 750. Hey, hey. Nissan Juke. Nissan Juke, yeah. 1500. Is it a SUV or? Yeah, this one is uh, that part of the uh, So I want you to, to explain for me 
what's the difference between SUV uh, we have hatchback and we have a uh, saloon uh, those ones are modified with the shape like now for Axio uh -huh. we, call it, we keep it at the category of a family car a oh, family car family car uh -huh and it's lower uh -huh. compared to if you take this car uh, it uses a, a, a tire size 18 size 18 tire is size 18 uh -huh. so uh -huh. this one you know, we normally call them the 4x4 4x4 four four. now for Nissan Duke, uh -huh. La4, uh -huh. Toyota Vanguard, uh -huh. Toyota Prado uh -huh. those are 4x4 four four cars 4x4 four uh, four cars yeah. okay but if you take the Axio, Axio uh -huh. Builder uh, wheat. Mm. Those are small cars. Oh, those are small cars. Uh, yeah. So th that's why they are called? The 4x4, mm. the ones that you are calling SUV. SUV. Yeah, then the other category of small cars. Okay, I had something by ground clearance. Uh -huh. Is this the one that defines SUV? Or? Yeah. Oh, yeah. so uh, the one that... I mentioned about the wheel. Oh, the wheel? Yeah, size okay. 18. Size 18. Yes. So for the Nissan, let's go there and then explain it when they are seeing it. So this is an SUV, guys, size 18 of the wheel. And then we are going to be explained about the, the SUV, this one. You know, they are bigger in matters of body. Oh, SUV are bigger yeah. in matters of the body. Mm -hmm. That's a car that you can go with it even in remote areas mm -hmm. without, yeah, stress without like kukonga gonga yeah, in yeah. bumps. So the ground clearance is up. Yeah compared to the saloon yeah. so the saloon not, are saloon. The, eh. not normally saloon even the hatchback if you take this one this, this is, is a hatchback. hatchback this one is hatchback yes. okay yeah. uh. but if you take the ground clearance the ground this, clearance ground no. clearance means guys from this to here it's very low like the distance is very small but the one from the nissan juke it's up yeah. all right uh, and the saloon we can go and explain for the saloon, the saloon is uh. This is still hatchback. This one is hatchback, hatchback also. Okay. So. It's a saloon. Corolla Axio. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. 1500 cc, 5 seater. 1500 cc, 5 seater. Yes. So now, for it. This one, it's using a wheel size 15. Size 15? Yeah, size 15. Okay. So this one, uh, uh, in case if you want to go to the remote areas, you uh, have to, to consider. You have to consider either way, uh, uh, installing a bigger tire uh -huh. or uh -huh. you install uh, heavy duty springs. Heavy duty springs. Yes. Oh, so guys, that's actually some of the things that you need to, uh, to consider when you're buying a car. You might be buying a car and you stay at remote areas and that car is going to get spoiled in a few days. Yeah. So you have to compare whether it's a SUV. So for example, somebody who is living at the mountains, corner corner, let's say in Moranga, you know Moranga, how corners, there are so many. So which car can you advise somebody who stays there and they have to go there? SUV is okay, but still, you uh. know, also it matters with the budget of... Uh, a person? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just, okay, I'm asking for those people <laughs> so that they can understand. Yeah, even budget, by the way, matters a lot. Yeah, yeah so anyway, if you know that the terrains that you're going to use, they are very tough, it's good to go with the SUV yes. car. Okay. But also, if you purchase this one, you can just install the heavy duty springs. Heavy duty springs, and yeah, then you can just ones, go. They, they normally assist you not to damage the car. Okay. The under. The underbody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, guys, you've heard from him. So, yeah. the, if there is somebody who likes likes a speeding, <laughs> which car? <can> I <laughs> We have sport cars there. Sport cars. Zagvera, Subaru, Zadea, mm -hmm. the GTI. GTI. Zadea. But then how much is GTI? GTI right now we have a small one. No? Uh. That one we are selling at 1.7. 1.7? How many CC? Uh, 118, uh, 189. It's a V-Wagon. That one is a VW. VW. Oh, Volkswagon. Yeah, we see it. Alright. Okay. This is what I uh, ISIS. ISIS. It's a seven-seater. Seven-seater. Family car. Family car also, PSD car. 
Mm. It's a business car. Okay. Ah. And this one is a? This is the twin. Toyota, uh, uh, I, this is Toyota Wish. Toyota Wish? Yes. But I can see they have written Honda. No, this one is not Honda. Ah. No, this is Toyota. Oh, this is Toyota? Yeah, this one is Toyota. Oh, yeah, for sure. I saw like it looks like H. Ah. Several of them, there is a point silver and silver, they are three units. So they are CC? This one is 1800 CC. 1800 CC all liters? So the ICC is 1800 CC, although it has a 2.0 liter. 2.0 liter? That means what? Uh, the CC also. Oh. Okay, the engine capacity. So how much are they? This one, this one? Uh, for ICC, we are selling it right now at uh, 1.8. 1.8 million? Yeah, Toyota Wish, we are selling it at 1.9. 1.9. Yes million kenya shillings but all of them are seven seater and they are family cars oh wow and that's nice okay so we are just moving guys huh? so all of them these are the same model okay hey filda hey it has it's so it's so beautiful i think it's because of this same shape same shape with the axio axio Five seater. Five seater. Yes. Oh, nice one. Okay. This one you are selling at one point eight thousand. One point eight million. Yes. Okay. There is this one Axio which has G W X B. I'm a see Evo. Evo. Yeah, that's a grade. That's a grade of a car. Oh. So how much is it? It has a lot of features. A lot of features. To the normal one. Ah. Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. For that one we are selling at. Uh, Two million. Two million yes. shillings. And this one is at one Even point. The field the WXB also we are selling at two million also. Two million. Uh, it has leather seats. Leather steering seats. Controls. Uh. Steering, steering controls. Steering controls are the ones that helps in line assistance, yeah. right? Yeah. Like when it sees a car, it blinks red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that you don't move. When you're parking, it helps you also, right? Yeah, in fact it creates an arm mm. when you are moving from your lane. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so this one is a this is a Mitsubishi RVR. Mitsubishi yes. RVR. Yeah. Wow. It's a five seater. Mitsubishi. And it is a SUV. SUV, the yeah. ground clearance is up. Yeah. Okay, Mitsubishi R RVR. RVR. How much is it? Uh, this one we are selling it at 2.4. 2.4? Yeah. 2.4 yeah. mil. Hey, see, but in a car cheap and it's a big car. Yeah. Or Mitsubishi, they are just like that. Mitsubishi, the cars they are a little bit cheaper. Yeah. But also, right now, the spare parts are there. The spare and parts? Before, when people were fearing. Oh, they used to fear to buy yeah, the Mitsubishi. Yeah. Because when even you walk uh, along the roads or when you're driving, it's very rare to meet a Mitsubishi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless right maybe now, you're in Nairobi. Right now, you get a lot of them. Uh -huh. yes, the, spare parts are the spare parts have come. Yeah, the maintenance is very easy. Oh, the maintainers? Yeah, so yeah. they don't like as spoil, spoil their parts, Araka. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Toyota Beats. Toyota Beats. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh -huh. This is a five seater. Five seater. This one you get in a thousand cc and a thirteen hundred cc. So probably the prices are very different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so how much is this? This one we are selling at two one point two five. One point two five. Uh huh. 1300 cc also the same price okay although it's the price is slightly negotiable oh it's a slightly negotiable okay we have Mazda Demio there. yeah Mazda Demio <laughs> wow it's Mazda Demio new shape new shape by the way it looks like a Zella yeah, yeah. okay this one you'll get in Petro and diesel Petro and Petro diesel and oh yeah. okay Full loaded car, yes. like you don't have to add anything. You are not adding anything unless okay. you want to do the modifying and the arms and uh -huh. the modifications of the heights. Okay, modifying. Uh -huh. But the ground clearance is up. Yeah, yeah. So this is a hatchback, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So guys, nowadays I know hatchback, right, saloon, SUV. <laughs> yeah. So I, I hope you also learning. So this is a Damien. Yes. Wow. Mm -hmm. The baby blue here. Yeah, that's, uh, Suzuki, Swift. Suzuki Swift. Okay. Oh, here we have uh, a Pro Box. Uh, Pro Box. Yeah. But nowadays they have a different shape. Yeah. Hmm. 
Now oh, this one you can't compare it between uh, purpose and uh, succeed right now because the shape is the same. The shape is the same yeah. with a succeed. Yeah. Succeed is it a pro box or it's not a pro box? It's a twin. Oh, it's a twin. Yeah, though oh. succeed it comes with a composite. Okay. The seat of succeed. No. They are very comfortable. They are very comfortable. Oh. This one is faster, but for pro box, huh. uh, just a normal seat. Okay. Oh, that's nice. And it has already like. Did you fix it or it came just? It came like that. It came like that. So let's say a car comes, like you don't fix anything. You just sell it the way it came. The way it is. Oh. Because you normally have the links of the car where it's in auction. Mm -hmm. So the moment that they arrive here and then you remove the carrier, mm. the client should demand okay. for the carrier of the car. Oh, yeah, the details because, like. Yeah, mm -hmm. because you provide the links of the car where. Hmm. It came all the way from the overseas. Okay, yes. so guys, that is it from this yard, JM Motors, right? Yeah, so we still have this one here. That's a Nissan X Trail. Yeah, new ship. New ship. Yeah, this is a 2017. This is a 2016. 2016. Yeah, I love this rim. Uh, ah, they're very smart, guys. Look at how they're sparkling. Mm -hmm. This one you get in five, five or seven seater also. Five and seven seater. Yes. Ah, yeah. I feel like if it's a seven seater, it's not comfortable. Some of the seats. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's, it's comfortable. Really okay. In fact, the moment you, if it's a seven seater, there is no any comparison between you owning a Prado and me owning a Nissan X. Ah, yeah. really? Yeah. Oh wow, this is nice. So how much is it at the moment? Yeah, this one we are selling at two point eight. Two point eight yes. million. Yeah. Uh, Masema ni Nissan X3. Oh wow, but it's quite big compared to the other model that I've seen. Yeah. Quite big. Wow. Okay. So these ones we talked about them. Yeah. The Axela. Ladies in Nairobi really love this because yeah. we can attest to that. <laughs> okay. So uh -huh. any where we need to go. Mazda, oh, another. So this is hatchback, and then we have the saloon model. Okay. The saloon is here. Oh, the Axela. Wow. Also, Honda Fit is here. Honda Fit is still here. This Fit is also a twin of Nissan Note. Oh, a twin of same category. Same category. Uh, this one is a 13 and CC. Also, you can get a 15 and CC of it. Mm. Out of petrol. Mm -hmm. Also, if you want manual, yeah. it's there. Oh, wow. Yeah. How much? Uh, this one you are selling it at 1.4 1. 1. million. Yes. So, you also have a. Is it a Hila? Yeah, Sorry. It's a Hila. Wow. Single? Cup, single? Uh, the Hila's single cab. Single cab. Yeah. Single cab means? That one means, you know, there is a single cab and a double. Oh, the one that has other seats yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so this is a single cab. This one is a single cab. So the cab is this. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, hey, it has a very big space. Yeah. For, uh, okay, I usually see people who are on Hilux with the single cab. They usually transport timber. <laughs> I don't know if guys are saying the truth, but I usually see them. Yeah, transporting no, timber this car you know you can't buy it as a family car this one is yeah a this is not a car. this is a business this car this one is a commercial car yeah so, wow uh, they, they need those uh, big jobs mm -hmm. if you are selling cement mm. you have that, uh, if you have a hardware timber yeah. business yeah, yeah, yeah. you can buy this it toyota well. it can serve you well yeah. so how many liters for this one is a 3.0 liter 3.0 yeah, liter so with, uh, manual diesel, manual diesel. Yeah, okay manual. manual so let me ask you about this i don't know I, I don't know guys if it's a myth or i'm just confusing myself i want to ask you people say that manual cars are very stronger and they can like you can go with the high speed it in a shooter speed very fast compared to automatic how true is it you know normally okay. these cars are uh, that you get manual hmm. most of them they are diesel diesel and diesel cars are very powerful really yeah they are very powerful but okay. 
speeding of the car it determines it matters with the driver yeah. himself. Oh the driver gari si gari driver that's why you hear you have a pro box but you are not moving faster like the meru guys who are transporting yeah uh -huh. so the same case applies Oh, so gari ni dereva. Gari ni dereva. <laughs> Guys, have you heard that? I know Kenyans are understanding this. Gari ni gari ni dereva. Okay, so also, but on your head while driving, mm, I think there is that limit that you can't go. You can't go beyond. Okay, so there is another myth whereby a car is 180 km per hour. Like it the yeah, yeah, kitu nafika 180. Yes. But when it reaches at that 180, some other people say that it has gone beyond. Is it true? It, like it can go beyond that 180, but the limit is at 180 or 280? It can. It can. Uh, but you know, the moment it moves like that, we are destroying it. Really? Yeah, because mm. uh, the manufacturer, mm. he knew the reason as to why he is uh, putting the limit to be the 180, 180 or the 260 or the 150. Okay. Yeah, so the moment you are going past that, you're uh, destroying the car. You're destroying the yeah. engine, right? Oh, so that's good. Uh, I'm learning. So guys, today I've learned that the uh, the diesel cars are very powerful yeah, compared very powerful. to the petrol. Oh, wow, this is nice. So we are heading to another place, the showroom, right? Yeah, the showroom. We are heading to the showroom. So this is just a yard where you store your cars. Yeah, this like is where we store the cars when the showroom is full. When the showroom is full, yes. oh, so this is a store. Yeah. Literally, this is a, a store. Yes. So you just have a showroom where you sell the cars from. Yes. So we are heading there, guys. Just keep on following us so that we go and uh, learn. So guys, we are actually here. So we are getting into the to the yard. This is a yard or a, a showroom, right? Yeah, to the showroom. Yeah, so let me get in. So the same cars that I'm passing, we've already talked about them. So we are going to speak about these here big machines. <laughs> and Chalo is here. So Chalo, which car is this? Uh, that is Suzuki Escudo. Suzuki Escudo, a 2016. Yeah, okay. Uh, and then the engine capacity. 2.0 diesel. No, that's a petrol. A petrol? petrol yeah. Five-seater. Yes. How much? That one is selling at 2.5. 2.5. Okay, so next. Next is Nissan X-Trail. Nissan X-Trail. Seven-seater. Seven. Oh, seven. The other one was a five-seater. Yeah. So this is a seven-seater. Seven wow, it looks quite big. Yeah. Almost a Prado. It's a big machine. Uh -huh. Big machine. Uh. The CC? Uh, the CC, that is a... 2000 cc 2000 cc yes. and then uh, that one we are selling at uh, 2.8 2.8 wow big slightly machine slightly negotiable wow and then this is a vw this is a vw passat oh this is a passat yes yeah, <laughs> uh -huh. 1400 cc 1400 cc five seater five seater yes. at how much uh, this one we are selling at uh, 2.4 2.4 yes Oh wow, 1500 cc. Guys, will you tell us something about VW? Uh, <laughs> Passat. VW, this is a hard machine. Hard? German machine. It's a hard body. Uh -huh. and also, it matters of uh, it's a sport Power. car. Oh, it's a sport car. Yeah, its engine is very powerful. Though okay. it's a 1400 cc. Okay. It's very powerful. Very powerful. Yeah. Like you can't compare 1400 cc of a Toyota with a VW. Yeah, yeah machine yeah. so this is a germany machine yeah. and like toyota is from japan durable, durable. Yeah. wow oh this is cx5 yes. okay has it changed the shape or yeah. it's just it the same uh, 2.0 liter 2.0 liter yeah. and then uh, the price you are selling it at uh, 2.9 2.9 million yes. oh wow it's quite expensive then we have a subaru forester, subaru forester. hey most of the uh, cops uses this, yeah. India. Yeah, cops here in Kenya. Most of them, you'll find them with a JK Eb with this kind of car. So, how powerful is it? It's very powerful. It's uh, 2000 cc. 2000 cc. Uh, we are selling it at uh, 3.3 negotiable. Negotiable. 3.3 yes. million. Yes. Wow. Okay, so those are the spoilers on top, or are they no, called? Those are the roof rails. Roof rails. Yes. It's Spoiler a... is normally at the back. Oh, yeah. okay. Roof rails. Yeah, 
Okay. But for that one, it has some the way it is. Oh, the way it is. Eyesight. Eyesight? Yeah, eyesight. And uh, also the dash cam. Oh, yeah. the dash cam. Oh, the dash cam is the one that records, yeah. right? Yeah. I wish we had a key, we could have shown them, but you can show them. Huh? Yeah. We will open. Okay. Yeah, another very beautiful car here, Mitsubishi, right? Yes, uh, mm -hmm. uh, Outlander. Outlander. Yeah. Hey. Uh -huh. How many liters? We can open. Okay, so let's open and get in, guys. Hey. Uh, that is uh, 2000. 2400 cc 2400 cc yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so this one we are setting it at uh, 3.2 3.2 yeah. this mm -hmm. one is a new shape a new shape yeah 2017 model 2017 model okay so how much is it uh, 3.2 million. 3 million oh wow let me open the other door and show you guys how it is i hope it's going to open yeah it is how it is wow so you see one two three four five six seven seater nice one mitsubishi outlander Fresh. looks so beautiful mm -hmm. this is a jeep uh, yeah this one is a jeep compass mm -hmm. jeep compass yeah jeep compass mm -hmm. This one is a, a 2.4 liter also. Mm -hmm. This one we are selling it at 3.3, negotiable also. 3.3 million? Yeah, 3.3 million. Okay, so 2.4 means 2400 cc. Oh, I was already with the music. Yeah. Hey, I love the music. <laughs> oh, wow, nice one. So this is the, the controller is up compared to the other ones which is here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so the features here are it has a steering controls mm. uh, although the seat is a cloth interior mm. base, it's very uh, comfy mm. uh, then it has a screen oh this one no? yeah yeah it's okay a, it's uh, a five seater oh it's a five seater it's a five seater okay so the other seater let me go the other side you're saying the other features? You can check at the door. Mm -hmm. The other street. The one that assists you in uh, check on the parking and everything. Oh, the screen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can see. Yeah, but you let can me show them. Let me open the door, guys. I show you like it has a screen which helps you in uh, parking. You see everything. Like you cannot hit another car here. So the screen is here. You see? The screen is actually here. It's show, showing me the next car which is there. So it's not possible to hit another car yeah, in it's front. Very hard. It's very hard. Yeah. Oh wow. So what's the mileage of this? This one is uh, at 90,000. 90,000. Okay. Wow. I've actually remembered another important thing when you're buying a car. They say that you consider the mileage. Yeah, the mileage. So maybe somebody who is watching they don't know what about like the mileage is you can explain for them you know the moment mileage is lower mm. maybe like uh, 50,000 and below it means that that car was not used a lot much, yeah. mm -hmm. as compared to the one that is coming with 100 and something 200 and something mm. although according to us and the experience that we have mm. the moment the car reaches at uh, a mileage of 100,000 mm. there is a lot of things that they change Mm. They have the auction. Okay. They change a lot of things. So? Either engine wise, the mm. things that they may think that they have been uh, destroyed, mm. they do change. They do change. Yeah. So but when normally it's the clients they come for the lower, lower mileage. mileage. It goes with the grades. Like oh. now the mileage below 50, uh, 30. Uh. Sometimes you get with others with 20,000. Oh. That's a 4.5 grade car. Mm -hmm. 4.5 grade yeah, car yeah. okay That's so that good. means when uh the ma okay when the mileage uh, is up it means it has been used for so many years yeah, there yeah, yeah. like not okay so not years, so many years like the really frequency on yeah. how he's using it yeah, yeah, yeah. maybe he's going all over with yeah, it yeah, yeah. okay but well, you get others they buy like you get others they 
maybe the workplace and mm. their homestead it's a shorter distance. A shorter distance. Yeah. So that means they travel for maybe a, a kilometer a longer or two kilometers. Distance. Yeah. yeah, so guys I hope you've understood about the mileage. Actually that's one of the important things that people do consider when they're buying cars. So I also knew that when you're buying a car you have to go for the lower mileage. Yeah. Yeah, because it's uh, like it's not used a lot, like it has not traveled for a longer distance. Right. Yeah, according to the kilometers. So for them, they call them mileage. They go with the mileage. But here in Kenya, we go with the kilometers. Okay. We have to Auris here. Auris. Yeah, it's a five seater, mm. 1800 cc. Mm. This one we are setting it at 1.9. 1.9. Yeah, this is new shape. New shape? Yeah, new shape. Oh, wow, it looks That's good. Okay, so most of the cars you've marked them. This is a chassis number or? Yeah, that is a chassis number. The chassis number. Okay. This one is marked there at the sea. Oh, it's marked at the sea. Okay, another. The CFS, not the sea. Oh, <laughs> at the CFS where the clearance is yeah. being done, right? Okay, so uh, let me ask you another thing. Yes. So there is this point where a friend was buying a car and they were told you can buy a car but it's still at the CFS. Mm -hmm. Okay, like, how is it? Do they come and they restock them there? Or, okay, you can just explain how it happens there. Very sorry. <laughs> I was asking, like, the car, he bought the car yeah, and then... the CFS. Yes, oh. it was at the CFS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he was told to wait for it to be cleared, be cleared yeah. from the CFS yeah. to that come is a storage. here. CFS is oh, a storage. it's just a storage. It's a storage where we store the cars as we they wait the to process be? of... Clearance. clearance oh yes. so, so that's when you get to pay the tax yeah, yeah, yeah. when it comes here yeah. in kenya you pay duty mm. uh, you pay the kra mm. those are the things that are uh, meant to for for the cars to be stored over there oh. so as a car dealer what are some of the challenges that you sometimes encounter when you're selling the cars you know mm. in this industry sometimes you get uh, clients who are not clients Clients are not clients. Yeah, they are not serious. Oh. Sometimes you can get a client who wants to be moved around. Mm. He comes here, he checks this car, you have to open, you have to go with him, maybe at the CFS, mm. the one that you mentioned. Mm. But the client is not serious. Number they were two, just we taking clients, you around. You have clients who are, no, who are thieves. Also. Thieves? Yeah. They come and steal the car from here? Yeah, not, not stealing, uh -huh. but they, get, they, they are looking those, for those alternatives. Alternatives? Uh, on how they can steal from you? How they can steal. Like now there is a time I encountered the same. Mm. I came with the car from the CFS when mm. you park outside. Uh -huh. You are making the parking to, to uh, the car. Uh, All of already? a sudden the car was, the ignition was on. And then so he flew the with the car? just entered and... Flew with the car? Flew with the car. Wow. Yeah. What? Guys, imagine you're coming with a new car from the CFS and then somebody... So it did you get the chaos. car? No. That's how it came. Yeah, yeah. Because one, the car has no any security. Mm. It, uh, the we tracker. Have not, uh, installed the tracker. Mm. The car is direct from the CFS, so the car is like a shell that just the way it is. Oh. Uh, so there is no way you get it. Okay, there is another myth. I don't know if there are myths. People say that cars in Mombasa. Most of the people who have okay, like most fast car owners they usually prefer coming to Mombasa because they know the port is just here yeah, the yeah. cars uh, just from here from the port yes. so they prefer coming to Mombasa than Nairobi or any other place yes. and they have this notion that in Nairobi cars are very expensive or any other place like yes. my place is very far from this place like Migori so is it true or it's just a myth or it's just a say or we just assuming it's true the cars here in Mubasa they are cheap mm. because right now here in Mubasa we have almost around 400 uh, showrooms 400 showrooms yeah, so there wow. are varieties mm -hmm. the client has uh, every right to come here mm. check the car mm. negotiate go to the next showroom mm. like, like you can see a lot of cars yeah, yeah, eh? but in Nairobi there are not more varieties yeah, yeah, to yeah. compare about yeah. Oh, and also, so it's, you know, Mombasa is treated as a tourist attraction. City. Yeah. So most of the kind they do prefer coming here, so that so the, also they can explore also. Oh, yeah. explore a lot of things yeah. here. Going to the beach, 
Oh, yeah, so guys, I think you've, we have mentioned everything. And uh, another important question that I was asking is about the mileage. So the mileage, have, have, it's like, okay, even me today, I've understood about the mileage. Yeah, I know it's time to break. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so guys, that is it from here. I hope you've learned something as well. I've learned something. And uh, if in case you're planning to buy a car, you can just contact GM Motors. And I'm going to put their number here. So thank you so much for watching this beautiful. And let me know in the comment section, how do you think about this video? Was it informative? Was it educative? Yeah, let me know in the comment section. So guys, for me, I just love bright colors. If I will be asked, I'll go with the, this. Um... Uh, Subaru Outlander or the small one which is the Axela looks good and looks girlish anyway I'm not planning to buy a car I'm just saying about it so thank you so much for watching may God bless you abundantly uh, for supporting me and uh, for everything so in case you're in Mombasa let's catch up thank you and bye bye